Getting a bit crook. Again? Maybe. It's never <sighs> that every day. Jackson probably gets a cold every third day. Alright, look how good the day is down here, Jack. Pretty amazing. It is good. I've just started learning how to use Snapchat just now. Jackson's been teaching me. So follow me on Snapchat, everybody. <laughs> What's your Snapchat? What is my Snapchat? <laughs> Matt, What's my name? Matt, Matt Steinway. Matt Steinway, that's there you it. Go. Nice right, spaces. Let's get into it, Jackson. Hey everyone, welcome to another Monday Morning Stella! Okay, beautiful day down here, Jack. Let's pan around, have a look at the people down here. Can't even hardly see them with that lens. <laughs> Looks like there's nobody on the beach. All right. Um, okay, I'm going to talk about rodeo. So, you know, these whole videos are about sharing some energy with you, getting you thinking, moving in a direction. Like I've been moving in a direction for 20 years now, headed in a place and, you know, it's building more and more momentum in what I do. I'm going to do more videos too. Um, I'm expanding the stuff. So you're going to see lots more videos coming and all sorts of stuff. Got a lot of good ideas that I, well, I think they're good ideas. I've got a lot of ideas that I'm going to start doing for you guys. The other thing is, all you real estate agents out there that are watching this, Eric is on in the next three weeks. So make sure you get your ticket. It's going to be the best conference yet. And for those of you who don't know what Eric is, it's Australian Real Estate Conference. So you feel free to come too. All right, I love this scene. I love this scenery down here, Jack. Nice. Yeah, really nice. nice <laughs> all right, so I want to talk about rodeo. I was watching a rodeo yesterday, a couple of days ago. I was watching ages of it, like maybe an hour of it, and there were pretty, some, some pretty serious bulls in there. And one of the commentators said something really interesting that got me thinking. And he said in his American accent, oh my goodness, whatever his name was, Joey Bob, he looked down, and when you look down, you're gone. And that's pretty much what he said. And then he went on saying about in the rodeo, you can't look down. As soon as you look down, you, you go there. And that's it. I think they ride for about eight seconds, something like that. And they get some serious banging around going on. So one guy killed it. One guy was on the biggest bull, the craziest bull. He killed it. He was on for eight seconds plus, And then he jumped off. Some people get on there for one. And then I started looking at where are they look where are they focused on what are they looking at and you could see as soon as they were going like this <laughs> as soon as they were going like this and then they got almost chucked off and then they looked down then they would fall you 80, about to. 88 and a quarter last week in sacramento this is gonna be good wow pick a spot bring in some on. big air oh but brian canner hey, 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 hey. goes down hard hey, hey, hey. So my question for you today, as we head into this brand new week, is where are you looking? Where are you looking? Are you looking at what's possible, at what you want, at what you're dreaming about, or are you looking at your bills, at your relationship hassles, at your stuff that's real, raw, and ragged? Are you looking, what's got your attention? Has the ground got your attention, or has the sky got your attention? That's an awesome question. People quite often ask me, Matt, how do you do the same thing over and over and over again? For those of you who don't know much about real estate, my results are industry leading. And I do it in a place called Terrigal. And people quite often ask me, how do you do it? How do you do it year after year? Create these results that are industry leading, I guess. I'm focused there. I'm focused there. Every day I start with a clear focus of what I need to do. That's all I look at. I don't look at the ground. I look at what's possible. I look at what needs to happen to all go together to get me to this place where I want to be. I can see where I want to go. I can see my vision is so programmed in my mind. I know what I need to do to get there and I just have to endure. I just have to keep walking in that direction. And I love the rodeo analogy because I reckon when you focus somewhere, you give that energy, that becomes bigger and it pulls it to you. You get pulled to it, one or the other and you move in that direction. So doesn't it make sense to understand what you want, to have a vision around what you want, to know the steps to get there and just focus on that, regardless of what's happening in your life. It doesn't matter what's going on. Shift your focus. 
Shift your focus from the ground to the sky. Look at what's possible. And if you have a hard time doing that, look at other people that are doing it already. There's heaps of them out there. There are so many people that are already doing what you want to do. Study them, feel their energy, look at them. Spend your time looking at that. Don't sit and watch the news. What's the news? The news is full of negative, really ordinary stories that get your attention. It gets your attention. That's why so many people watch it. Yeah, people say, I need to know what's going on, but think about it. Show me one news program that you've ever watched that you feel amazing after. You see people get blown up. You see this person get bashed. You see this person get stabbed. All these things, car crashes, train crash, whatever. Where does your attention go? It goes to that. It goes to the ground. It goes to that space that doesn't make you feel great. But when you consciously learn how to train your mind to go to the sky, You'll want to, it'll become a habit. You'll want to focus up there more. You'll want to see what's possible, solution oriented, better feeling place. And when you focus down here, you'll do it short. You'll, you'll get better and better at it where you do it hardly at all. And when you look at the ground, it'll feel weird and you'll only want to look at the sky. And if you only want to look at the sky, Jackson, where are you going to go? To the sky. To the sky, good boy. You'll only go to the sky. You will only ever get what you focus on, what you focus on grows. And then you just have to walk towards it and train your mind to focus on the sky. Come on, Jack, let's go. Let's get our balls and we'll get in the rodeo and we just won't look at the ground and we'll be right. All right, thanks Jack for your awesome work. Guys, let's get into this thing. I know, I know all your dreams will become your reality. I know it. You just gotta learn how to do it. Look forward to seeing you on the next video.